All right, legendary rapper. Look, man, we got to put some respect on DMX's name. Mr. Telefero, how's everybody doing? We got to put some respect on DMX's, uh, DMX's name. There was a two to four year stint where DMX might have been the biggest rapper in the world. All right, we ain't going to act like that didn't happen. When I was very young, we ain't going to act like that didn't happen. Anyways, um, look, man, DMX does not make the best decisions, right? He, he'll tell you that himself. As a matter of fact, he stood in front of the judge today and said, I'm too old to be doing the things that I'm doing and admitted that he ain't been thinking straight, right? DMX has had one hell of a, a life, all right? He's <laughs> he's had one hell of a life. Some of these things self-inflicted, I'm pretty sure he'd tell you that as well. Some things, maybe just circumstances, put him in situations where he's trying to battle himself out. Here's one thing for certain and two things for sure. DMX lucked up today in court. And I know a lot of people will be like, yo, if you got to serve time, there's nothing lucky about that and i tend to agree with you i wouldn't work wish jail on my worst enemy right or prison on my worst enemy but what they were trying to give dmx for tax evasion today trust me he lucked up federal prosecutors wanted dmx to serve the max five years for tax evasion and that comes from the fact that dmx was granted a bond a few months ago and while he was on bond dmx failed a drug test so they wanted him to serve the five years they're thinking yo we let you out and you go play with our time and you you play with our uh our lenience to you and you go fail a drug test they wanted dmx to serve five years but the judge gave dmx only one year so dmx will serve 12 months in prison right he's heading right back to prison he's done stints in the past after that one year behind bars he'll have three years of supervised release and um hopefully from there dmx can get his life together I don't know if DMX needs to be incarcerated for what he's dealing with right now. I think he's making bad decisions, but I'm a type of dude who I believe if you're not hurting somebody physically or you're not hurting anyone's pockets, I really don't care about people going to jail or going to prison for tax evasion. It's just not my thing. It just seems like there's got to be some sort of thing to suffice for that, right? Make somebody go work at a certain place every day for a year or two to pay off some of the debt i just don't think they need to be behind the same bars that people who commit murders are going to be with i just don't think those things those things should mix for tax evasion lying on some taxes or not doing the taxes correctly whatever um before he struck this plea deal, deal in november though dmx was facing 44 years so again he struck the plea deal then in court today he was facing five years federal prosecutors wanted to push that because um, when he was out on bond, he failed a drug test, but luckily DMX will only serve 12 months, one year. He'll be out three years of supervised release, and then he'll be able to go on with his life. And, and he probably won't even serve the whole year. DMX, he, he does a lot of preaching in his spare time and he's, he's very, very biblical. So I believe DMX will go in there. He start talking a lot of uh scriptures from the bible and i think they'll let them out in four or five months to be honest with you good luck to dmx again y'all y'all talk to me in the comment box below about about what i said i just don't think people who lie on taxes or whatever evade taxes whatever i just don't think they need to be in the same place as people who've committed murders but dmx will be doing a year's worth of time and then he'll be out y'all talk to me coming box below what's your favorite record for dmx yo they were trying to get this nigga to go in in court today and play one of his classic records i don't think him playing stop drop run around run, run, oh i don't think that would have helped his case i'm glad he didn't do that but <sighs> good luck to dmx i'm out i want to salute you homie you know for for building your own thing and doing your own thing creating your own platform your own website I got one life to live out my dreams, and I'm giving this thing all I got. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I represent the culture. Right now, you're turning up on MrTalaferro.com, shawty. Yeah.